let's replace the Earth with Pluto and see what happens. So it looks like Pluto keeps a stable orbit. Let's see what's happening with the composition of the planet. So the Earth's similarity is increasing quite quite quickly actually. It's already up to 20%, currently going at 1.8 months a second. Life likelihood still is 0% though. Visually the planet looks about the same so far. Let's go check out the surface temperature and see what's happening there. So the temperature is dropping quite quickly. It started at minus 220 and it's already worked its way down to minus 120. Let's see if we can get life on here. So a few years later and the Earth's similarity is at 40% but the life likelihood is still at 0%. Visually the planet still looks about the same, although a bit of the ice does appear to be melting on the other side. After a few more years the average temperature has dropped to minus 50. So life likelihood is still 0% but the Earth's similarity has increased to 47%. Looking at an overview of the planet it looks like it's just a big one big water world from where the ice has melted. Let's fast forward a bit further. So moving about 15 years later, looks like the temperature is kind of averaged out at about that minus 34 point. The Earth similarity hasn't changed, it's just sitting at the 48% and still no life likelihood. And there you go. That's what happens when you replace the Earth with Pluto.